what is going on youtube it's your mario be coming at y'all with week three of the prep city tour the pct uh this week we are taking on just lucas and his hellblaze volcaronas man do me a big big, big favor and go check out lucas who will be linked in the description down below along with all the other beautiful pct coaches um we decided to play this game at 6 30 in the morning my time so i'm a little bit sleepy i'm a little bit more gentle voice so hopefully during the battle that ch that changes a little bit but yeah um i'm gonna go be going ahead and doing like a quick little team breakdown nothing too crazy i'm not gonna do this super long just kind of want to explain what i'm bringing and why um and i also want to give you all a fair warning you know if you all haven't checked out the battle from last week um or the one before that or even the draft analysis you don't even know what this is about man go check the description there will be a playlist uh labeled pct playlist and there we'll have all the videos compiled together of our week one our week two and our draft analysis so i'm gonna go ahead and spoil our record in three two if you haven't checked it out go check it out man one zero uh we did take the l last week against the homie shake quaza uh a, a 3 -0 loss if, i believe so we won week one 5 -0. we lost week two 3 -0. so we're at a one and one record with a plus two differential and uh yeah man looking to make it two and one this week hopefully we can we have a really really tough opponent ahead of us and yeah let's go ahead and break down the teams man so uh i also will have time uh time stamps in the description down below for y'all to uh find yourself in any part of the video that you would like to okay so Basically, uh, team matchup is going to go up now. You see that my opponent has an Iron Moth, a Wo Chen, a Don Bozo, an Iron Thorns, which is his Paradox uh, Pokemon, not his Paradox Pokemon, but his uh, Terra Pokemon, a Haxorus, a Cryogono, a Pincurchin, a Salazzo, a Hatterene, and a Squawkabilly. So my team, it, the team that I'm expecting him to bring is right here. I do expect the Don Bozo and the Hatterene combo. He's been bringing it all season, kind of like Rocky Helmet Don Bozo, also like a uh, assault vest nuzzle hattering which has been really really annoying so uh definitely expecting that maybe the squawkabilly i know he's been having a lot of fun with it this season i don't know if it's gonna be choice scarf choice banded it really depends um and then the uh you know the iron thorns i'm expecting it to be like terra steel maybe life or maybe booster energy i'm not really sure exactly what he wants to bring but definitely d dance with terra blast dual stab maybe just the rock the stone edge and then like an earthquake maybe uh, i'm thinking earthquake because my best check to it is the guard organical so i really think that he brings either fighting or steel because organical can kind of hard wall it uh if they don't they don't end up bringing it so the old chen because it does a really good job at checking my dragon pole um and uh i'm thinking the haxers man i think haxers is gonna make his debut here i think i, I don't know i think he brought it week one but uh yeah haxers i definitely think is gonna make his debut maybe the cryogono because of spin like his spin support so that that's something i can see them definitely bringing um i don't really see the salazzo coming i don't really see the pink kerchin coming i don't really see iron moth coming just because i do have a check in skeledurge to it skeledurge actually kind of hard walls it so um i don't really think they'll bring it uh the iron moth but yeah so that's gonna be his his team what i'm expecting him to bring so let's go ahead and dive into a little bit about what i'm thinking here so um as you can see brute bonnet is a three attack spore mom with life orb this thing actually puts the fucking team on its back man it breaks down his walls like crazy so wo chen doesn't want to take a close combat if it's spadef it does just die um don bozo is two hit ko after rocks with, with life orb seed bomb uh which is really cool sucker punch does a fuck ton to all his mons it's also there as a backup stab along with um of course my uh my power uh backlight went out um Sucker Punch is there is just a backup for like D Dance Haxorus, uh, D Dance uh, Paradox Titar. Uh, you know, Sucker Punch is just really good damage on the Squawkabilly. You know, if it's not, uh, you know, if it's not heavy duty boots and I manage to get like a, a Rocks up, it's taking damage and then plus the Sucker Punch, it has a really good chance of knocking it out. So that's basically what Brute Bonnet's there to do. Crocodile is my Choice Scarf Mon, basically there to outspeed a uh, plus one Paradox Tyranitar. Iron Thorns, I think it's called, right? Um, we yeah, had just Stealth Rock, Earthquake, Gunk Shot, Foul Play. Um, and, and big shout out to all the front office, uh, my, my front office homies that helped me out, man. So shout out to Trico, shout out to Cherry, shout out to uh, Hanbi. Um, they, they insisted that I put Crunch on this, uh, but I really want to keep the Foul Play there. Foul Play is there just in case they're Booster Energy Iron Thorns and they get a D-Dance up. Uh, foul Play will do more to it if it is uh, Booster Energy. And then I don't want them to be like Steel or like Fighting or Flying Terra type. Uh, so I don't want to rely on the Earthquake too much. So Foul Play, I think is a good, a good bring. Gunk Shot hits the Hatterene that wants to switch 
switch into crook uh also hits the woe chin for a little bit more damage so basically why i did that choice scarf like i said just to have a good speed tier there um i don't i'm not max speed so i don't speed tie the squawk ability so if they are choice scarf squawk ability that's something we have to watch out for but this does have intimidate so i can get an intimidate off on the squawk ability if it wants to come in next is dragapult very very interesting set shout out to hanbi for this one he suggested that i bring physical which i actually really really like here physical ghost so uh yeah terra blast uh with the ghost um with the ghost uh terra is gonna do a lot to hatterene man so uh that's, that's a really good bring u-turn does a fuck ton to wo chen uh since it is the bug and it's four times weak to it uh you know and it, and it, we actually have enough speed on it to outspeed a plus one iron thorns as well so that's that's really cool um but yeah just a really good breaker this game uh the good thing i like about this too is that after stealth rocks uh dragon darts into a uh, dragon darts um into draco meteor after rocks actually has a really good chance of okoing don bozo so you know don bozo does come in it's max hp max defense you know takes the dragon darts and then we draco it it has a really good chance of killing so that's what that's for scully dirge here like i said just my main check to iron uh moth uh basically like a lot of spadef uh to, to eat hits from it uh only bad thing is if he brings overheat uh we're, we're, it's kind of scary but we can oko with earth power in one hit so that's really cool torch song just to boost up our special attack shadow wall just to do some good neutral damage slack off of course to recover right so nothing really special about that rotom heat is just uh you know my defensive pivot here this game for things like his iron thorns his haxorus his don bozo mostly i don't have a really good switch into the bozo on this team as you can see uh, maybe brew brawn if i want to be offensive but mostly the road i'm here you know getting some momentum with volt switch uh their ground type is they don't have a ground type actually so no ground types of volt switch is actually very very free against their team just getting free pivoting um and then hydro pump discharges a lot and the will-o-wisp is really nice against the iron thorns if i come in it's at plus one um you know we we live any hit they want to go for we can wisp it a uh, haxorus as well if it's not mold brick or earthquake we do live a hit um and yeah we can shoot up those those really good will o -wisp along with squawkabilly so that's cool and then halucha here i was really torn on what i wanted to do with halucha man i was kind of scared of like a spice stacking pin kirchen if they wanted to bring it um you know toxic spike salazzle if they wanted to bring it so i'd say just to bring boots with defog roost uh braver does really really good damage i wish i could just fit dual stab on this but i really wanted to put encore on there i think encore helps a lot with um you know a dombozo that's like i don't know rest curse rest uh rest sleep talk uh it helps with the uh it helps with uh like a spiking a spike stacking set i don't know i just thought encore was there i had feather dance on there to minus two attack i was just like you know i don't know i i, I don't know that last slot was kind of like could be anything but i kind of wanted it to be more so utility also i could encore the um the wo chen as well which is a big thing why i wanted encore on there so that's gonna be the whole team breakdown it was a little bit longer than i wanted it to but i really hope that y'all enjoy it and uh, i'll be right back at with y'all with the battle what is good to youtube it's your mario b coming at y'all with week three of the prep city tour the pct draft league this week we're taking on my good buddy just lucas and his hellblaze volcarona and if y'all are excited to catch this battle definitely definitely make sure to show your support by leaving a like down below if y'all are brand new as always definitely definitely consider subscribing man so uh you know if you missed any of our past uh pct battles there will be a playlist in the description down below titled prep city playlist i think it should be called pct playlist um but yeah you can catch any of our battles from the past two weeks in there so i'm gonna go ahead and spoil it for y'all that maybe have not watched it yet so if you haven't watched it make sure to go check it out um i'm about to spoil it in three two one we took the, we took the l last week man we took the l it's all good though we're gonna try to bounce back this week against my very good buddy just lucas hopefully i'll have a team breakdown at the beginning of this video if i don't i do apologize um I, i'm actually recording this at like 6 30 in the morning uh right before i head to work so um yeah i actually did something new too where i turned off the background music so now i have like some new more playing in the black i'm gonna have some glitch city playing wide battle let me know if y'all like that better if y'all like the original in-game music we can definitely keep it like that as well but yeah we're gonna take on lucas um i'm bringing a team of brute bonnet which is really really exciting first time showing up and uh it puts in a lot of work here and you see the six that i'm expecting him to bring right here so let's go ahead and get ready to change that i am still very tired i'm very half asleep um he does bring the iron moth and the cryogonal no hatterene okay cool so um let me see oh yellow squawk ability i don't know what the different squawk abilities do which is a little scary no haxorus 
and no hatterene instead he brings the iron moth and the uh, other thing what's the other thing called um the cryogonal cryogonal okay cool 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 cool, cool. um that's actually kind of kind of good for us um i'm gonna go ahead and lead off with dragon pants i think uh we have some pretty good i think the matchup is fair here i think we just have to play well we've been playing kind of bad lately um, but I definitely think we have a good chance of winning this game here. So, um, Dragon Pants going to put in a lot of work. Do I want to reveal that I am Life Orb right out the gate? I think I'm okay with that. Um, you know, if he does bring in the Don Bozo, I can always just like U-turn into like, um, Lavadora, uh, probably let off a free discharge. They have no ground type. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think this is this is good. Uh, Brew Bonnet actually puts in a lot of work here as well when it comes in against the Wo Chen or the Don Bozo. So yeah, let's just lock it in, man, and have good luck, have fun to my buddy Lu just Lucas. Um, it's cold, man. I know, I know, you, all y'all East Coast folk are gonna make fun of me, man. It's like 50 degrees over here in LA right now, and um, I'm, I'm freezing my ass off. So. Hopefully the game will warm us up a little bit, but let's go ahead and get it, man. Good luck, have fun to the homie. I forgot to tell him. Um, good luck, have fun, homie. Okay, he actually needs this. Okay. So I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. You know what? I don't. Would he be? He would be scarf on this. I don't even know if I want to risk that. Um, the scarf iron moth kill my guy here, my dragon pants. It doesn't. I don't even know if it gets Dazzling Gleam. I think I just want to... We live with Dazzling Gleam. Um, so I think I am just going to... I actually want to Terra too as early as possible. So I'm going to Terra and then I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, yeah, I'm just going to get out of here. I'm just going to get out of here. Oh no, I hope I changed it to... No, did I not change it to Fairy Ghost? I did, I did. I go, 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 go fairy ghost yeah because that will help me resist its uh its thing here okay cool 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 it, it was scarfed good thing to know we're gonna u-turn here and now this just gives us a kind of a free um it gives us kind of a free uh skeleton here it just gives us a free boost here so uh gives us a free uh torch song that's for sure so let's go ahead because this thing actually puts in a lot of work against my guy here. Um, and I'm not at that little health. Uh, they're going to switch out into what here? Don Bozo is the worst thing here. Uh, I guess maybe Torch Song. Yeah, it's the special uh, boost. Um. I'm out speeding max speed iron moth, so I should should be fine here. We know it's scarfed. Yeah, this is gonna be Dom Bozo. Let's see, Dom Dozo. Let's see, how much does this take? Okay, it took about yeah, as much as as much as I would assume here. Stud dirge. Um let me see, yeah, plus one. Where? Right. Um to Rotom here. I also like next time I think I'm uh after the Rotom play, I think I'm gonna go into um next time after I go into Rotom, I think I'm gonna go ahead and yeah, this is just a liquidate. That's fine. We're like max HP. So I think here we do get a free volt switch off, and I think if I uh, if he stays in, I'm okay to just like go into my root bonnet here. So I'm just gonna Oh, actually I do have Willow Wisp. What would he bring in on this on the Volt Switch here? uh on a bolt switch here what would they bring in let's see let's see what they bring in and i, I think i'm starting playing faster because i know i'm already like getting into my calcium my calcium mood whoa chin okay perfect whoa chin does come out here i'm just gonna bolt switch here um i do just like going dragon pants and u-turning I am like life orb physical. And is that is okay, is that okay? And I think I'm okay to just U-turn into a uh, brute bonnet here. 
Okay, protect. Cool. Okay, okay. Yeah. Because the hatter is not here, so I'm not, really not stressing too much about uh this thing really like cleaning up or anything. This thing can really do some really good damage to the Don Bozo. Um, especially if Don Bozo this is this is gonna do a lot if they stay in here. Okay, they're actually gonna stay in. Perfect. That does a fuck ton. Perfect, perfect. Okay. And I am going to go out into the brute bonnet and hope that they don't go into anything else. They go for leech seed. That's perfect. Knock off. Okay. That's great. That's kind of good for us because honestly, we, we kind of don't, don't need our life orb. Um. Yeah, I'm kind of scared they're going to go into Dom Bozo here, but honestly, I don't think Dom Bozo can even do that much to me. So I'm going to close combat. The threat is in the mushroom. The mushroom, the mushroom, the mushroom, the mushroom. Among us. He is among us. They are among us. So, uh, this close combat is going to hurt. Yep, they're going to switch out here. What are they going to switch out into, though? Solar winds. Okay, that's fine. And I wish I would have. Uh... Holy moly. <laughs> that's a crit, baby. Um. Uh, what's this thing called? Iron Moth. This thing is scarf. We know this thing is scarfed. Versus my brute bonnet without a life orb. Sucker punch will kill, so I'm just gonna click it. I max attack adamant. Ah, okay. What are you gonna go for here, Lucas? Isle, which is gonna be the squawkabilly. Squawkabilly. <laughs> Squawkabilly. Um, I'm gonna switch out into my crook, I think. Squawkabilly. Sucker does a fuck ton to this thing. God damn. This uh this mon actually puts in some really good work. So get the intimidate off, which is nice. Uh, I might just get in my rockers, actually. Okay, you turn. Go play. Holy smokes. That did a lot. Uh scarf crook, scarf crook. How much do I love scarf crook here? How much I love the scarf crook? How much I love the scarf crook? How much I love the scarf crook? How much do I love uh love a scarf crook here? He does have rapid spin. And I, I do have a good blocker. Okay, he's gonna go into this. Um oh, oh, salt rock, fuck it. Can't be scarf on this. I doubt he rapid spins. Like, I might sack off my scarf for here, which is kind of fine to me. I, my, my dragon pole does outspeed a plus one iron moth and I do have sucker punch. Okay. So Lucas is just going to be swapping out here. Darwin's. This thing. Cool. And it is booster energy. Awesome. Okay, cool. Attack. Okay. Get up the rockers. I'm going to go out into uh, my designated check for this thing and hope that I just don't get 6 out here. The good thing is that it shouldn't get too out of hand here. As long as it doesn't get up two dances, as long as it's not dancing twice, we should be, I think, semi okay. Is he Terra ground, fighting, steel, fire? Interesting. Okay. So you can't be will o -Wist, actually, when I think about it. Okay. He's going to dance up. He's going to dance up. He's going to dance up. Okay. So very, very interesting. He won't fire. I wonder if it's because he didn't want to get burned by me. Um. Which, if he did that on purpose, that's that's pretty awesome by Lucas to, 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 to know that. So I think I'm going to hydro pump here. Um, I kind of want to discharge actually, just because what's higher, the chance to para or the chance to miss? Chance to miss uh, para is higher, so I'm gonna hydro pump here. He punch comes off here, good god, that does a lot. Oh, and we do hit perfect. Okay, cool, cool, cool. That's great. Oh, awesome, awesome, awesome. That's great damage. Uh, that's great damage. I really want to go into crook to try to be cheeky, but crook is definitely my like way to win this. So I think I'm just gonna discharge here. Okay, I should have gone crook. 
but rotom wash does go down okay rotom wash does go down that's fine with me uh this is some like oh my lord did i forget to put the battle music on i am so like i'm so silly okay i want to swap in my crook here i'm swapping my crook um get off the intimidate and i'm scarfed uh i could scarf earthquake but i think i like locking into foul play a little better cool there we go cool so this thing is out of the way a huge huge threat to my team uh i do still have my scarf uh which is awesome and uh i still do have my uh my guy my my halooch my halooch you should go into squawkabilly now i think leviathan okay it actually goes out into this thing here oh i'm stupid i am dumb i am silly um scarf 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 i don't need to scarf no more i want to foul play here oh no okay that's uh is that the worst that's actually not the worst you know what i'm saying that's actually not the not the not the worst thing that's ever happened here so um Actually, not the worst thing here. Okay. I'm pretty sure this thing's unaware, though. So, this is what we're going to do. Check it. This is what we're going to do. Very, 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 very important. Very, very important here. Yep. Cool. Okay. going to encore this guy. He's going to keep resting. And then we're going to go drop a couple Dracos. <laughs> Unaware mons should, should ignore the, the Dracos, you know what I'm saying? So I am just going to go hard into my uh, my guy here. Um, I'm going to go hard into my Dragon Pants here to get off a of Draco. And uh, yeah, Unaware mons don't don't realize that I'm just dropping special attacks. So I'm just going to hit him with it. Hit him with that smoke. Okay, he is going to switch out. What do they go out into? legacy which is going to be the iron moth oh this thing perfect 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 um and my after dumb bozo's gone he's gonna protect here huh i don't protect lucas the time don't protect don't protect the time yes okay perfect he's gonna let this thing go down great cool 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 iron moth is gone oops Okay, well, switch up with the music. Yeah, this thing is one of the few things that I have that can take this thing down. So, um, I do just like going out into, I think, maybe Crook. Crook a Scarf. Crook a Scarf. Uh, I'm going to Tomungus, actually. Try to bait out the squawk a bit. Squawk a bit. Or squawk. Uh, plant, try to, uh, you know, the uh, the other thing. The, the, the ice cube. Squawk a bit. Is it boots? It's not boots. Awesome. So this thing, after one more round of rock, should be in range. Uh, I think I'm going to go out into Halucha here, to be honest. On the Brave Bird, maybe? I don't need Halucha too much. But Encore is nice, but I don't really need it too, too much. So let's see. Among Us does come out. They don't switch out. If they... Ugh, I don't know. Lucha Libre it comes out here. Yep, breaks the mold. Brave Bird, Double Edge, Quick Attack. Okay, cool. Hustle, 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 hustle. Okay. I am just going to Brave Bird here. Okay. That's Banded. Perfect. Squawkabilly. Squawkabilly's done. Don Bozo is really going to be the hard thing, but I think if I can uh, put him into range with my Among Us... Solar winds, perfect. Okay, question is, do they try to be cheeky? Okay, they take the rocks. Um, no, they don't be cheeky, right? Because they're just sack this thing for nothing. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna be cheeky with this. I think I could just go into my uh, my dude here. Yeah. Okay. Cool. 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 I will be taking stats, but I really don't think I can afford it. Fire blast comes out here. We're gonna eat. E Whoa! That did a lot more than I thought it was gonna do. Um. I want to I want to slack off here actually. 
Yeah. Okay. Perfect, perfect. Uh, I think I want to stack off one more time. Yeah. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. We should be like around full. And then I'm just going to... um, And then now I'm going hit, to hit him with a Shadow Ball. Yep. Okay. Now I hit him with a Shadow Ball. And then I'm going to go out into... um. I'm going to go out into... uh. The brute bonnet on the Don Dozo right now. And I'm gonna um Yeah. It's cursed though. I should have to C bomb that shit. I hope he gets no curses. Don't you curse at me, you dang kid. <laughs> okay, let's see, let's see. So uh mushroom's gonna come out here. It, okay, so it's curse. It's curse. Um, it's curse liquidation. So, please don't get a curse. Please don't get curse. Perfect. Okay, cool, 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 cool. This shit three hit KO. This shit three hit KO here. Um, let's see, bomb. Shit three hit KO. Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. I think even after. Oh wait. Oh no, he's gonna rest. Okay, he's gonna curse here. Okay, I think we might need a crit, man. We might need to crit. Um, if we had the life orb, we wouldn't have to worry about it. But I do think we do need to crit here. Let's see. Let's see. Can we get a high roll? Let's go. I'm Mugus, you're going crazy. I'm Mugus, you're going crazy. Let's go, baby. Amongus is going crazy. Amongus is going crazy. Among Us is going crazy. crazy. Perfect. And this thing is boots, and we saved the Skeledurge just for this. So we can just go into Skeledurge here, and we can just um slack off a couple times, let off a couple Torch Songs here. Yep, they're going to spin, but no spin here, sir. And then we just can just Torch Song here. Perfect, man. Flash Cannon here. Let's see what this does. 40 or oh, nothing okay awesome you can't even you, they, they can't probably can't really touch us so we're at torch song here um and i think we're just gonna go ahead and pick up the w man um we're gonna pick up the w here awesome and it's it's gonna be a, a 5-0 man it's gonna be 5-0 that's awesome that feels great i'm glad <laughs> i'm glad i didn't wake up early to get like 6-0 you know what i'm saying i'm glad i woke up early to, to at least you know have a good game at least you know i feel like our prep was really good this week um so shout out to all the prep city homies man who helped out uh well, actually, it wasn't Prep City this week. It was actually my private front office. So, actually, I meant to shout them out. Uh, but big shout out to Trico. Big shout out to uh, Trico. Uh, big shout out to Cherry. Big shout out to Hanby, man. So, appreciate y'all. Uh, we do take the 6-0 victory. Brute Bonnet putting the team on his back. So did Dragon Pan. So did Crook. I think I feel like everyone put in work, man. I think I had to give the thumbnail to uh, Among Us th this week, though. So, yeah, man. Good games to just do because make sure to check him out in the description down below. He's a really, really kind fellow and uh, one of my one of my favorite people uh, playing Pokemon right now. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. I'll catch you all on the next one. Make sure to leave a like. Make sure to subscribe if you are brand new and I'll catch you all on the next one. Peace.